Yeah, we are going to Dindivanam near Pondicherry for a show. The show is just like, uh, I think, uh, film music. We are a professional uh, light music orchestra in Pondicherry. In music, in music only, we can, we can live uh, in India. We can uh, earn some other uh, jobs also. They are all doing some other jobs. I'm a government employee and uh, I'm working as a telephone operator in uh, the government general hospital, Pondicherry. Daily we will be performing different kind of uh, songs. We will be performing in different stages and in different places. So according to that place and according to that peoples we will perform. It's, this is a rural area. So we used to put only fast numbers only. <laughs> But he's a very good genius. He's mindful of music. 
He's an experienced man. Yeah, full of music. Full of music. He's a Kalliman Matele. He's a roundabout 45 years from light music group. Light music group. Not only dabla, keyboard, guitar, drums, any instrument, he will be play very nice and he smell cool all round and hot. According to our culture, dancing is not allowed in the public. According to our culture, dancing is not allowed in public. The people dancing means the policeman will come and catch that fellow and they will go. <laughs> Because each and country there is a culture and there is a manners. So here they should not dance and we should not be able to perform pro programs in Pondicherry at around. After 10 we will not be performing because there is no permission. Only. My grandmother only joined me here to sing. Now I became a singer, professional singer. My name is uh, Saumya. I am 12 years old. I had three aims. I specialist and uh, engineering uh, in uh, <laughs> Indian information technology. Indian information technology and uh, as a singer. <laughs> So there is a uh, joyful life and there is a sadness life also in each and every field. Now we are, uh, we are, uh, now people will be sleeping and we are uh, <laughs> sitting and we are uh, making uh, and making enjoyment and we are laughing here at around two o'clock. <laughs> 